to the main event. Joanne, nothing happened last night. As a matter of fact, okay, let's I don't see what Mikey happened. Nothing happened that I know of. As a matter of fact, last night after you talked about not having fear, I went home and slept like a baby. Me too. <laughs> Listen, I've never heard a baby snore that loud. The cor <laughs> Listen, what it should have said was you slept like a chainsaw. Slept like a slept like a chainsaw. That don't make no sense at all, Brandy Bernard. Yes, it does. It does. Because you were sawing logs all night long. <laughs> Good one, Bernard. <laughs> oh, I'm usually gone with the flow, but that guy last night, he gave me the heebie-jeebies. Heebie-jeebies. You give them here right now. My mama told me not to ever take anything from strangers. And if you got something from Linus Minus, you don't need to keep it. What is a heebie-jeebie anyway? Little Mikey. <laughs> I think what Flo means is that he kind of scared her a little bit. He didn't actually give her anything. You'll be all right. Well, you know what? Speaking of attacks, if Linus Linus did an attack last night, then we probably, you guys help us be on the lookout, we should all probably be on the lookout tonight just in case he decides to attack Kids Crusade. Can you do that for me? You know, I'm glad you said that, Pastor Joanne. You know, I don't know if you noticed, but last night I accidentally pretended to bump into Linus Minus. I did that just in case uh, he, anything he tries in, in Moo Holler. See, what I did was I put a little device on him that acts as an early warning system. And if he tries anything, uh, a light will flash and an alarm will go off. And it will switch to a video camera that lets us know what he's doing and if he's up to any kind of mischief. Oh, very smart, Brainy Bernard. Wait. Wait a second. What good's a warning system if we don't know what to do about the attack? Well, I think that, you know, we, we've asked God for wisdom, and I think that he's going to, to be able to come in and kind of show us what to be able to do through this alarm system. You know what? I believe that God has given us wisdom. I mean, we prayed last night. Did all you guys go home and pray last night for yeah. Blue Hall or Blue? God is going to answer our prayers, and if Linus Minus attacks us tonight, we're going to know exactly what to do to make sure that we win the battle, because we're the winners, right? God's on our side, right? And what was our memory verse last night? We don't have to be afraid because God is with us, right? So we're going to make Linus Minus afraid, aren't we? That's right. Oh, that's awesome. Well, you know what? Because we are putting so much trust and faith in God tonight. Back in the Bible days, whenever they were getting ready to go into a battle and they were trusting God to help them win the battle, do you know what they did? They would praise God with everything that they had. They would sing and they would dance and they would just praise God with everything that was in them. So I hope everybody learned your memory verse. Did you guys take your cards home and learn your memory verse for tonight? Wave your hand really big if you learned your memory verse. Okay, it looks like you both have some people to choose from over there. So it's time for us to get ready and to start choosing who's going to play the memory verse. Wait a minute. What is going on? Set them up, our flow. Set them up. All right, looks good. Help me, Lord. Oh, so I might close. Just get double digits. Okay. Help me, Lord. Oh. Do the do, do the do. Okay, it's your turn. I'll set them right. up for you. All right, give me. I'm ready. I'm a better what? bowler than you. What? What exactly are you guys doing? What are y'all? What are y'all two doing? We're trying to help them learn the memory verse for tonight. Hey, I'm just going with the flow. That's all I'm doing. Here you go. I want to try it. You know, we're, we're just learning the memory verse. Didn't you Little get the Mikey, memory verse? What exactly do you think the memory verse for tonight says? It says, 
that uh, so Oh, carry on. Sorry. You know, all them lessons you've been giving me have really helped out. I bowled a 31 the last time I went. Woo! Double digits. Yeah. Okay, now, little oh, Mikey. Sorry. Well, the, the memory verse says, uh, so that I may boldly say, you know, mm -hmm. boldly yeah. say, that I don't have to fear what man may do unto me. Yeah. Mikey, that's not what the verse says. Man. Yeah, but you know Mountain Dew's not good for you. Yeah. It makes people hyper. I know it, but that's not what the verse says. Flo, why don't you straighten him out? Hey, don't look at me. I'm kind of new to this Bible verse stuff, and it kind of made sense to me because I'm addicted to Mountain Dew, so... Okay, well, we it just never, never ceases to amaze me what you guys come up with every year. But anyway... Um, I think you two should probably listen to the Bible verse. We're going to go over it with the kids. And I think you'll understand that it didn't have anything to do with bowling or Mountain Dew. But y'all got it, right? Yeah. All right. Yeah. <laughs> okay, can we have the memory verse up on the big screen? Everybody oh. ready? Can you guys see that? It says only. Okay. We're going to go through it just a few times. So can everybody say it together with me? So that we may boldly say, the Lord is my helper, and I will not fear what man shall do unto me. Also, Flo, speaking of the memory verse, did you understand what that memory verse meant tonight? I think so. Um, let me see. Um, the Lord is with me. And because of that, I don't have to be afraid of anything that comes my way. That's right. That's right. So good. That is really good. Uh-oh. Lotus Lotus is up to something. That's that alarm Bernard was talking about. Oh, no. Do not be alarmed. I am Wisdom Woman, first of the Ascenders sent by God to aid you in your battle against the evil Linus Minus. chapter 1 in your Bible, it tells of me and what the weapons of wisdom are. Justice and judgment, knowledge and discretion. People of Muhalla, listen to me and I will give you wise counsel. Yes. I think we should listen if she says she's in from God. We just heard the alarm go off and, and, and we're not sure what we need to do. So we know that Linus Minus is getting ready to attack. So will you help us? To fight this battle that we're getting ready to fight? Mm -hmm. I certainly will. Yeah. All right. Oh, what's that we left? They can take my power from me. For even as I speak, my wolves in sheep's clothing are coming against their children. So rejoice. listening to, mister? Who gave you this mess? This nice man gave it to me. I love this music. These are bad words and they should never come out of your mouth. Whoever gave you this wolf pod is in big trouble. Great job, Rebel. That little boy's too young to understand what I'm even saying. I get his attention with the music and before long, the words I want him to say get stuck in his head. Yes, dark thoughts, hatred, disrespect. I use the words in the music to paint pictures in his mind. The more he listens, the easier it'll be for him to act out those thoughts as he gets older. Catch them while they're young and innocent. Train a child when he's younger and ha ha ha. 
minus, minus. Is going to attack the children of Moo Holler. It's a, it's a good thing that that mother took that wolf pot away from him before it was too late. What are we going to do now? Oh no. I must go to the battle. weapons are too powerful. I must increase my attacks and come up with new tactics if I plan to destroy Moo Holler. I will win this battle. of God. I stand for wisdom. If you seek me and cry out for me, I will always be sent by God to help you. Thank you, God, for helping me. I am, the, I am the first ascender. Those who go to and fro over the earth at God's command to help his people. You are in a grave battle. But do not lose hope. For God has heard your cries, and you will be victorious. Yay! Hello? What's the matter, sis? Franny's okay now. See, wisdom helped him. I felt all those same things that were attacking Bernard. I've always just gone with the flow. I thought it was a normal part of life. I just realized I've been under attack, too. You need... Jesus, Flo, that's what you need. And then you won't have to worry about all that fear. It can't attack you anymore. All right, kids. How many of you kind of got afraid when you saw all that happen tonight? I thought I heard somebody got a little afraid. But you know what? Do we have to be afraid? Because who's with us? God is with us, right? And We've already learned that we don't have to be afraid of what men can do to us. Tonight we had 67 girls. Let's give the girls a hand. We had 55 boys. 
for a total of 122 kids in Kids Crusade. We had 111 adults. So the grand total in the room tonight was 233. It's a pretty good crowd. The offering tonight, we had B and Flo came in at $92.73. And little Mikey and Brainy Bernard had $99.82. For a total of $192.55. But the best of all, we had four salvations. So let's give God a great big hand for that.